please pay attention. Uh, today we are going to start the construction of projections. Thus, on the basis of the shape and size of the earth, the spherical or the geoid shape of the earth, the shape of the earth is truly geoid. But we used to say geometrically, we used to say it is spherical shape. And how to represent the shape of the earth on paper? Paper is plain. Whether it is the wallpaper or atlas paper or your A4 paper, when you construct any of the map, the map is on, on, on plane. It's very so noise is coming from outside. So let's construct projections. To construct projection, like shape of earth is uh, spherical. There is the equator on zero degrees, and we have the longitude and the latitudes. But if we want to represent these longitudes and with the order, purely if I expand it on this paper, how to represent it in true shape? So true shape will come if I construct here like this and like this. Then another like this and like this. And another like this. So near the equator we are showing, but what about this area? This area we have to, like if we construct like this, then it will give the true shape. So on the projection, there are two, three things are there. One is, in the, by constructing the projection, there are three basic parameters of projection. It is having true area, or, or, or true area. That is, that is called homographic, homographic projection. So whatever the area is there, so if the area is small, the projection should show the small area. If you see the wall map, the size of Greenland looks like much bigger than India. But in truly, in, true, in an accurate area, it is much smaller than India. So it means it is not true uh, area. That, that projection is not showing the true area. Second is true shape. The true shape, shape that is called uh, uh, that, that basically the area uh, that is called orthomorphic projections. Antarctica. Antarctica is in shape of circle. It's a small circle. But if you see the map of Antarctica on the map, wall map, Antarctica looks like this. Yes. It is not like this. So if that projection is not given, giving the true shape. And third factor parameter of the projection is azimuthal. Azimuthal means two direction bearing. North ko north ki taraf upar dikhana chahiye. It should be parallel to longitudes. Longitudes are the true north of a particular location. So, where all the longitudes merge at one point. Ye sab longitude yaan merge hoti hai. But some projections we, we used to construct the projection sometimes ye longitude yaha jati hai, ye longitude yaha jati hai yaha. Where is the point? Yes, sir, where is the In reality, they are joining one point. 
but they are not joining one point. So for north, for this area, north is this. For this area, north is this. So wherever the longitude is there, so all longitudes are showing the true north. But this is not one. So always we have to find out the azimuthal character of the map. Koi bhi map dunya mein 100% true shape, true area, or true direction nahi dikha ta. There are some exaggerations. But as per the requirement of the, uh, the theme, whatever we want to represent on the paper, how much area we want to represent, so on the basis of that, we used to construct the maps accordingly. Now, how to construct the map, uh, projections? So projection, constructing the projection, uh, it is like, shape of earth is uh, like spherical shape. If we want to like, see, this is the map of the, this is the globe, if we want to construct the map here of like this, so this area, it is close, this much of area, we will find almost near the tangent, wherever it touches the line of the circle, this area is, uh, uh, will be alright, will be having true area, true shape, but when we go away from this line, this area is the, it means acceleration. In this area, acceleration is that much. So the picture will distort like this. Here, picture as we go away from the prime central uh, tangent, tangent wherever it touches. See, if we want to construct the projection here of this area, if we construct the tangent like this, so this area around tangent will represent the area properly but this area this area will not be represented properly but sometimes if we touch the tangent like this so only the polar area this area will be shown properly but what about this area away from the, this area will not be shown so this shaded area is the acceleration picture will distort, shape of the map will distort on this particular projection. So in such condition, we construct different uh, uh, techniques, we use different techniques on the basis of the construction. We use geometrical uh, techniques to construct the projections. Broadly, we have three different types of projections. Projections, the tangent is touching the equator. Where tangent is touching the mid latitude, where tangent is touching the pole. So the tangent, wherever the tangent touches the equator, we used to say cylindrical projections. Cylindrical projections means on this tangent we open the uh, uh, entire earth and we open the earth in the circular form we represent in the form of cylinder. So we construct uh, in, in the cylindrical form. Whenever these projections touch the mid latitude, we construct that is called conical projections. And the third Uh, the, the, the when it touches the pole, so, so they are called genital projects. Genital projects. So in your slippers, we have all the three types of projections you have to construct. So let's start with the cylindrical projection. So by constructing the projection, we follow RF on a particular scale. Scale may be small, scale may be large, whatever the value of this scale means we convert this scale into RF to construct the uh, particular projection. Now let's come over to the cylindrical projection. There are the different types of cylindrical projections. 
सिलिंड्रिकल इक्वी डिस्टेंट प्रोजेक्शन सिलिंड्रिकल इक्वल एरिया प्रोजेक्शन और द सिलिंड्रिकल मार्केटर प्रोजेक्शन द ट्रू सेफ सो लेट्स सी ऑल द बिकॉज़ वन सिलिंड्रिकल नन ऑफ द सिलिंड्रिकल प्रोजेक्शन शो द अर्थ प्रॉपर्ली सो वी यूज द प्रोजेक्शन एज पर रिक्वायरमेंट सो इफ यू विल लर्न the construction mechanism then you will be able to understand the purpose for the use and the merits of the projection so uh, it in and you have to construct it simultaneously with me in in your uh, practical record book now come over to the cylindrical projection if i give you one example say uh, this is limit let's come over to the rf if i say rf one is to 200 200 million so in 200 million on this rf if we want to construct the projection the cylindrical projection cylindrical equidistant projection very simple I will give you what is the diameter of the earth. We don't have the equal diameter. One, if 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 I say the diameter from pole to pole and diameter from equator to equator on equator because earth is spheroid. Spheroid. So the diameter in the central part of the earth is maximum. So it is twelve thousand seven hundred. 56 kilometers in reality, and pole to pole diameter of the Earth is 12,714 kilometer. This is less, comparatively lesser. So the diameter it is lesser. This is more. So 12,700. Then what would be the radius of the Earth? इक्वेटोरियल रेडियस कितना होगा जस्ट कैलकुलेट इट क्विकली रेडियस रेडियस ऑफ अर्थ रेडियस ऑफ अर्थ इज सिक्स थ्री सेवन एट एट व्हाट इज दिस व्हाट इज द यूनिट किलोमीटर ओके दिस इज द रेडियस ऑफ द अर्थ सो बाय कंस्ट्रक्टिंग द इफ वी हैव द Uh, scale uh, in RF in centimeter, then what would be the centimeter of this kilometer? Six three. If you will centimeter, then convert it. Six three seven eight one two three four five. This much of centimeter. This kilometer means this much of centimeter. Hope you got it. Yes. Clear head. Yes, sir. If you so by constructing the radius of the circle for constructing the projection, we should draw the accurate size of the earth. So accurate size of the earth is this. So most of the cartographer they don't use this figure. उन्होंने फिर इस फिगर को थोड़ा चेंज करके कुछ बुक्स में आपको मिलेगा कार्टोग्राफर कुछ यूज करते हैं सिक्स ट्वेंटी फाइव कुछ कार्टोग्राफर फिर यूज करते हैं सिक्स फोर्टी इसको राउंड फिगर में कर देते हैं सिक्स फोर्टी सो वी विल यूज सिक्स फोर्टी एज दिक्स फोर्टी इज क्लोजर टू एक्यूरेट रेडियस ऑफ दी कार so how to calculate the radius of your projection to construct the projection projection ko construct karne ke liye kaise the radius if the rf is this if we want to construct the projection of the world with say with 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 15 degree latitude and 15 degree longitude interval Interval is 15 degree latitude and 15 degree longitude. Then, how to construct this projection? First, we have to calculate the radius of the circle. How to calculate the radius of the circle? 
R is equal to what is the R F? One oblique. Multiplied by this value, six four seventy. Calculate it quickly. What is the radius in centimeter? Thirty two. Yes. Thirty two centimeter.